Hi boys and girls, Mrs. Claus here and I have a wonderful story I'd like to read to you. It's called The Night Before Christmas. The Night Before Christmas. Twas the night before Christmas when all through the house not a creature was stirring, not even a mouse. The stockings were hung by the chimney with care in hopes that dear Santa Claus soon would be there. The children were snuggled and warm in their beds while visions of presents danced round in their heads. And mother and dad in their matching pajamas could finally unwind without family dramas. Then out on the lawn, they heard a strange sound. Dad sprang from the couch to see who was around. Away to the window, he raced like a flash, tore open the curtains and peeked through the glass. The moon shone so bright on new fallen snow, it lit up the magic emerging below. When what to Dad's wondering eyes should appear, but a beautiful sleigh and eight magic reindeer. With a jolly old driver, Dad took a long pause. He knew in a moment that it was Santa Claus. Swifter than songbirds, the reindeer they came as he whistled and hollered and called them by name. Now Dasher, now Dancer, now Prancer and Vixen, on Comet, on Cupid, on Donner and Blitzen. We must make delivery before morning fall, so dash away, dash away, dash away all. As the crisp winter air swirled around, it flurried. All of Santa's sweet reindeer galloped and scurried. To the top of the house, up and away they all flew, with a sleigh full of toys, and Santa Claus too. And then, so delighted, Mom heard on the roof the prancing and pawing of each little hoof. How excited she was, and when they turned around, down the chimney came Claus. He dropped in with a bound. He was dressed all in red from his head to his foot, and his suit was all tarnished with ashes and soot. A bundle of toys he had flung on his back, he looked oh so joyful as he opened his pack. His eyes, how they twinkled, his dimples so merry, his cheeks very rosy, his nose like a cherry. His smile was as big as his best, ho, ho, ho! And his beard on his chin was as white as the snow. He had on black boots, a belt buckle of gold, and the ball on his hat was quite fluffy and bold. He had a broad face and a round little belly that shook when he laughed like a bowl full of jelly. Asleep they should be, dead felt like a spy, but frozen they stood in a doorway nearby. A wink of his eye and a twist of his head let them know it was fine that they weren't in bed. He spoke not a word, but went straight to his work and filled all the stockings, then turned with a jerk. Then tapping his finger aside of his nose and giving a nod up the chimney he rose. He sprang to his sleigh where the reindeer awaited. Then away they all flew in a flash they vacated. And they heard him exclaim as he drove out of sight, Merry Christmas to all, and to all a good night. The end. I hope you enjoyed that story. Merry Christmas.